Got it burning there. Yep, it's got a nice glow to it. Oh, so cold. Oh, oh God. God. It's nice. Oh. Warm up your tongue. Warm up your sausages, boys. We got a long night ahead. Oh, my. My circulation. It's not very good. You need to flex, you need to keep on flexing. That's how you get, get the arthritis as well. You catch 22. Yes, oh, this is nice, this is nice. How this cold winter night. Oh, yeah. Bless you. God bless you. Bless you. Bless you. Well, hopefully, you're not catching a chill there. Hopefully, that doesn't distract the bears. Yes, well. That, uh, Fire we left on that. It's always a risk, isn't it? Yeah. Ah, this is the coldest winter in years. I've never experienced such a cold, dry winter. Why would I walk outside? Hear the stillness of my feet trudging through the crisp snow. It's otherworldly, you know? It's like I'm not on this planet. Never did I think we'd be lighting a fire in our own home. Well, since the power grids went out, there's no internal heat. As we got to fend for ourselves, you know, and this is when there was a Boy Scout. Classes and clubs all come into, uh, come into play. Everything is just, really, you're really just being thrown right into it, you know? Well, thank the Lord that you took those classes, because I, I certainly did. Oh, I made it up to a uh, Wolf Scout. I even become a full boy scout like Joey. Eagle scout? I was an eagle Second scout. Second degree? Um, yeah, we called them hawk scouts. Uh -huh. So, you know, hawks, hawks are a little bit, they're a little bit lower than eagles, but, you know. Sure, sure. Well, you did it a little differently up in Canada. Oh, it's done down a little. Can you, can you stoke it? Stoke yeah. it quick. Taking the axe to all the other houses around the neighborhood. Yeah. You know, we're gonna have to get that wood because thank God there's still wood. Thank God. The eagles are gone, but wood still remains. And the bears have moved in. The bears have another moved. family of bears moved in. A few uh, a few houses down. Yes, yes. The bear goes the neighborhood. So many bears. People are dying. Eagles are gone, and bears, well, they're they're multiplying over. without their natural, the natural uh, predator. The bears have moved in. What color was? Um, never, never. Doesn't matter. It isn't a matter of race. It isn't I think a matter it's a of mixed race color. family. A, uh, the the papa's a polar bear. Yeah. Mama's a brown bear. But they are ferocious and mighty indeed. Get on their their bad side. They will not hesitate to rip your no, throat no, out. No, no, so, no. but uh, but you know you if you're friendly to them, they're friendly back. In fact, uh, Gerald D, who lives down at uh, number Cod six, the oh, the Kodiak, the Kodiak bear. She brought over a Jello mold while you boys were out the other day. Uh -huh. It was nice. It was That's it was so honey nice. a honey Jello mold made from scratch. Her most things are recipe. most things are honey from them. Yes. It is a bit unfortunate. And most things are also uh, made from scratch. It's a very creative breed of... Yeah, creative is a... It's, yeah, it's all honey. It's all honey based. It's all honey, but what they can do with that one ingredient is just incredible to me. But they will not be happy if they find out we have this fire, so we gotta keep it home. We gotta keep it down. Bears like, they like the cold, you know. They're like the Frankenstein's monster. They're afraid of fire. Should, should we sit a little closer? Yeah, why not? Sure. So I was just thinking I'm a little cold and it just didn't even occur to me to move closer to the we fire. We can move a little closer to the fire. We well, we were the smart one, Corey. Together. Together, yes. Yeah. And also, maybe, I think just a little, if we vibrate a little bit, it uh, warms up your body, you know, when you shake your knees, roast them. <laughs> That's what they used to call me. Yeah. 
uh, what they uh, still call uh, me. Uh, uh, the Wolf Scouts. Uh, uh, Back in the uh, Wolf Scouts. Uh, I was always an old young man. Uh, I was using that to keep my forehead warm. That hair? Yeah. That bear hair? <laughs> uh, yeah. Ah, I kid. I kid. I kid. I'm... I haven't found a bear hair on you, Brian. Yeah, I God, I'd suffocate you in your sleep. I shouldn't even joke about something that serious. No, we don't, we don't mess with those bears. Other oh, right. Well, don't you ever just wish sometimes we could put on the movie? Yeah, but all the, don't all you the miss VCRs the are extinct. I remember Don't you the miss the films? I oh, do films. miss the films, but but thank thank God we still have our word of mouth to tell stories, just like our ancestors. You know. Yeah. What's your favorite story, Brian? My favorite story? Yeah. Probably just uh, your classic hero's journey. Mm. Mm -hmm. It's been told so many times in so many different ways, but. Every single time it, it just touches me right here. It's thrilling. A young man thrilling. leaving home mm -hmm. to find himself. Going on a quest. Discovers himself. He a series of trials and tribulations. Exactly, exactly. Why well, I, I shouldn't tell you you were a, uh, a philosophy of literature major, so you know very well the thought process behind uh, the, the It tale. was an excellent the attribute I was able to bring to the scouts as well. The scouts, they think, Survival, they don't quite think psychology, you know. Not just physical survival, it's oh, mental. It's mental survival, mental survival. Too. It's, it's, it's about not just surviving as a base being, but, uh, but as a higher being as well. Recognizing your place as a higher being over the bears. And, and using this life to, uh, to, to explore that sort of thing. So I, I, really, I really hate the bears. I know. Do you guys hate them as much as I do? No, but you have personal yeah. history. Yes, what they but took. I don't. Carradine. I don't like that. Carradine. Carradine. And your mother, sorry, that I'm. Gwyneth. Bringing up. Breaking up old, old terra firma. Breaking it up. But uh, it's good to remember, you know. Remember the good times. Yeah. Because it stokes the fire in my heart for revenge on the bears. <laughs> Speaking of stoking the fire. I was just thinking, do you remember the last time, sorry I'm laughing again, but do you remember the last time you tried to invoke revenge on the bears? Just how poorly it went. <laughs> it went you running cool. down, <laughs> running back to the house mm -hmm. with the bottoms ripped out of your trousers. Yeah, I thought I was clever. I thought I was clever. Just to do it all by yourself. So, oh, but sorry, but it was stupid. I've got a, I've got a, a, a secret weapon this next time. I'm cooking up a better plan. Oh, would you like to share, or is yeah. this just? Oh, it's it's based on an old uh, an old old tale, long before the film. Oh, I'm sorry, will you just throw another log? Of course. Right before you continue, I have to <coughs> dive down. Have you, uh, you guys ever heard of uh, Goldilocks? Goldilocks. Do you remember this being told this oh. by your mama and papa? Remember I this? I think I remember. Goldilocks. Well, I met this young blonde girl at the grocery the other day while I was uh, scavenging, and uh, she's got kind of a Goldilocks quality to her, so I will have her um, thief from the bears, and uh, I have no problem with sacrificing her for the greater good in order to uh, get back at him. You know? That's, that's about it. That's, that's as far as I've thought it through. It's just uh, she's I willing. Know, she's willing to time. sacrifice you herself, or you're you're just she you've don't just become heartless these past years. Oh, I've certainly become heartless. I've since certainly. the grid, since the grid, went since down. the grid went down, since Caradine, since Gwyneth, I have. It um, just all piles up. It just yeah, all piles just up. Just talk of revenge. Just I've saying. been lucky. We've been lucky. Yeah, you've, you've, your families have been safe. We should, we should. How's, uh, how's Barbara doing, Corey? And Kenneth? They're, they're, they're yeah. hanging. They're hanging. How are they enjoying life on the moon? Well, they made it out. They were the last of them before the grid went down. I, I know. I, I received a message from them. Carl. Oh. Via oh, Star yeah. Telegram, I was reading about yeah. this. Yes. But, but I haven't received one for a couple weeks now. 
Interesting. Are you worried? Uh, a little. A little? Do you, do you, um, when did you learn how to read such notes? <laughs> <laughs> This is just the dumbest. <laughs> we gotta stop this. <laughs> we gotta really stop this. <laughs> it's perfect. We hit, our, we hit our mark. We're done. <laughs> uh, Merry, Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Happy holidays. <laughs>